The prospect of a flying taxi that lifts you over the traffic and speeds you to your destination is an enticing one, but are we any nearer to it becoming a reality? Flying cars, now known as electric air taxis, have been around for a long time in our dreams. But now, air taxis will soon become a reality. They will change the nature of travel dramatically, taking the well-heeled off the road. For short intercity and intracity travel, these taxis will soon replace cars. Electric air taxis come in several shapes and sizes, and many look quite different from conventional fixed-wing aircraft. Electric motors replace jet engines, and vertical takeoff and landing aircraft, designed to avoid the need for long runways, have rotating wings and, in some cases, rotors in place of propellers. Now some of you must be quite skeptical of the prediction. Primarily because the concept has not taken a visible shape anywhere in the world to date. Let us warn you though, the development on the technology has been going on for a while now. Germany-based operator, Volocopter, is expected to launch their air taxi service in Singapore in the year 2024. During the phase one of this project, residents and tourists in Singapore may be able to ride in an air taxi from Marina South to Marina Bay Sands, the Marina Bay Financial Center and Tanjong Ru and back. Volocopter plans to run the air taxi service over a distance of about 12 kilometers for 15 minutes at an altitude of up to 150 meters. The 15-minute flight will cover a circular path that offers views of Marina Bay Sands, the Central Business District, the Formula One racetrack, and the Singapore Flyer. In addition to its landing area at Marina South, Volocopter plans to build more voloports at Changi Airport, Sealtar Aerospace Park, and Sentosa in Singapore, and in Johor Bahru and Batam. Volocopter plans to offer a second route, which will see the electric aircraft, called Volo City, flying over Sentosa. Volo City is a fully electric two-seater aircraft. It has a max speed of 110 km per hour, and a range of about 35 km. Christian Bauer, Volocopter's chief commercial officer, explains that the Volo City's 18 motors are powered by nine rechargeable batteries, which can be swapped in between flights with minimum time on the ground. The battery swap design allows the battery to be charged under ideal conditions, significantly increasing the battery pack's lifespan. Volo City is much quieter than conventional aerial transportation modes like helicopters. Since all 18 rotors acoustically operate within a narrow frequency range, they cancel each other out to a high degree, so much so that the aircraft cannot be heard flying over the backdrop of regular city noise. Besides using Volo City for tourism purposes, Volocopter also foresees the use of its urban air taxis to enhance regional connectivity. For instance, a typical journey by car between Changi Airport and Johor Bahru now take more than three hours. With Volo City, a traveler will take just 30 minutes along the same route. Similarly, these air taxis can shorten the time taken for journeys between Singapore and Batam. The duration of the Volo City flight from Changi Airport to Batam is expected to take less than 20 minutes, reducing current travel times by around 160 minutes. This will benefit tech talents and digital entrepreneurs shuttling from Singapore and Nongsa D Town, a digital downtown that was launched in Batam last year. When asked how much a Volo City flight will cost, Bauer shares that it will probably be a quarter of the price of a typical helicopter ride during the initial availability. He expects the price to gradually reduce, and will be the same as a premium taxi ride in five to seven years after that. Volocopter's consumer study in Singapore also showed that 72% of consumers surveyed expressed high interest in flying in a Volo City Air taxi. While neighboring country Malaysia still ponders what happened to the country's first-ever flying car project, Singaporeans can now look towards taking air taxi rides soon. I hope you found this video useful. Please like, share and subscribe for similar videos in future.